from Rome, New York, the final super concert of the 20th century. Woodstock 99, 99. with Alanis Morissette, Collective Soul, Dave Matthews, Everclear, Fat Boy Slim, Live Everlast, Metallica, Cheryl Crow, Kid Rock, Brian Titzer, The Offspring, Jamiroquai, Jewel, Chemical Brother, Red Hot Chili Peppers, Counting Crows, Sugar Ray, Live from Woodstock 99. The all cool, all request open house party is on the air. Peter Doherty. Tenton, Oklahoma. What are you doing tonight, Peter Doherty? I'm hopefully partying. Oh, you should be at Woodstock with us. Yes, I should, but you know, it's a wee bit expensive for my blood. Hey, listen, if you got pay-per-view, I really suggest you watch it. It's like it's like the Spice Channel or Playboy. It's unbelievable what's going on up here. I think I'll have to get myself some or right. go to a friend's house. All right, so what do you want to hear? I want to hear Lenny Kravitz, Fly Away. Oh, perfect. For a night like tonight... Right now, it's just gorgeous here. It's about 80 degrees. Everyone's having a good time, right? It's hotter than hell in Hampton, Oklahoma. All right, well, thanks for calling up with House Party with Star. Okay. Music decisions are being made right now. Call toll-free 800-669-1010. The final decision is yours. I wish the day, 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 day. Actually, we're about 150, 200 miles from Woodstock, New York. This is Rome, New York, where Woodstock is at. I'm John Garabedian. Time now for Who Sings It? 800-669-1010. Last, Alanis Morissette, Jewel, and tickets to Woodstock. Good for yesterday. Yeah! Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Hang on. <laughs> Open House Party. Tonight, live from Woodstock. Alanis Morissette. Collective Soul. Dave Matthews. Fat Boy Slim. Cheryl Crow. Everlast. The Offspring. Jewel. Counting Crows. Limp Biscuit. Sugar Ray. And a half million fans. Right. Open House Party, live at Woodstock. Hello, what's your name? Sandra. And Jeanette. And where are you from? Quincy, Massachusetts. Quincy, Massachusetts. Yeah. Are you having fun at Woodstock? Oh, yeah. Not topless yet? No! <laughs> People are watching pay-per-view and you know what they're viewing. I know! <laughs> I've seen enough of those, you know? So you want to make a request? How about if you make a request? What do you want to hear? Pearl Jam! What's on? Last Kiss? Sure! Yeah! Oh, hey! Hey, my baby's in one Oh, yeah! Hey, can we get a picture with you? Sean. Sean, where are you calling from? Royal Oak, Michigan. Have you been watching this at all? Yeah. What do you think? I think it's pretty cool. What do you have, pay-per-view or MTV? MTV. Oh, they aren't showing the good stuff. Yep. Oh, there's somebody naked body surfing <laughs> right now. <laughs> It's the spirit of 1969 all over again. What do you want to hear, Sean? I'd like your Larger Than Life by the Backstreet Boys. All right, their hot new song. Yes. Now, what are you doing tonight? We're ready to go to a party. All right, keep Woodstock on. We're here all night long. Okay. Okay, over now. All right. Hey. Open House Party, we're here in the fabulous media compound with yeah. Carson Daly from MTV. Hello, Carson. It's fabulous. This is a fabulous compound being the operative word. I'm looking to set up my tent somewhere around here and sleep tonight. I'm going to turn your question on to you. Uh, how is your Woodstock experience? It sucks. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I should have just gone to the family values because that's basically all I want out of it. But uh, no, it's, 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 I guess it's great to do once. It's a once, it's a once thing only. Just to say that you're here and then to never do it again. Now, I wonder how many people are here who were at the last Woodstock in 94. I think Cheryl Crow's the only one. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, they do have great bands, so I'm looking forward to the uh, Limp Biscuit, and then uh, after Limp is Rage Against the Machine, and then Metallica. It's gonna be four hours. It's, it's gonna be a wild that, night. That four hours will be worth it for me. Well, thanks for talking to us. Hey, thank you. What's what's hot on MTV this week? Uh, Kid Rock. He's the man. He is. He is. He's cool. It's my boy. Cigar chopping and all. Yeah, he's my man. Just go pick up the album if you don't have it. Carson Daly, MTV. Thanks for talking to us. Hope thank you. Well, thank well. you. Okay. House party. Open house party live from Woodstock. I'm John Garavidia. <laughs> This thing's about 75% guys between the ages of 18 and 24 years old. Looks like tryouts for the Abercrombie catalog. Oh my god, and topless women everywhere. If you're watching MTV or pay per view, Sugar Ray didn't make it. Mark McGrath is sick or something. We'll find out more about that later on. This afternoon, a scorching set from Dave Matthews. Here's Ant's Marching Live. Open house fun. He wakes up Open House Party, we are here with Ed Kowalczyk of Live. Hello. Yeah, how you doing? I'm doing great, how are you? Good, really good. You did a great set. Uh, felt freaking, I won't swear, and you don't have to bleep this, freaking great. <laughs> <laughs> What's it like to be in front of a crowd this big? Oh. It's a rush, man. It's a rush. It doesn't end. Your your eyes can't see it ending, and that's that's a little scary, but pretty powerful too. What is the what's the mean to you? Anything? Does man, what's that? Of course it does. I mean, it's a tradition of you know an event that changed the pop music world forever. You know, and there's a lot of forces around right now that want to sit on the authenticity of this event, and I don't agree with that. I think that. You put 250,000 bodies and beating hearts in one place and you give them a message of love and and uh, urgency for the new millennium and it's going to be special, it's going to be cool. And I'm sick of all the people trying to sit on this thing and say we can't have our Woodstock. We can have a Woodstock. Get them all Y2K ready. That's right. One of the most moving things <laughs> One of the most moving things you did today was you dedicated lightning crashes mm. to mm. John Kennedy. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. When did you think about that? Well, it just felt right. You know, it felt like, the, I mean, the people of the 60s rallied around in the early years before he was, his life ended too early, rallied around that president. He, as far as I'm concerned, the last great president we've had in a lot of ways. And, um, you know, his son just died. And I, and, and I grew up with um, JFK mania. My, my parents were very in love with him and what he stood for. And it just felt right to me. And the, plus, the, on, on top of that, there's a beautiful, beautiful people, young people that ended too, their lives ended too early. And, and that's what Lightning Crashes is about. So it was just felt right, you know. It felt like I wanted to, I wanted to expose that. One of the ironic things that I, I think is the first Woodstock was in a time when it was anti-establishment, anti-commercial, anti-military. Vietnam was roaring on, and here we are now on a former Air Force base. It's either ironic or it's somewhat beautiful, you know. The fact that um, Woodstock, the great tradition of that concert, it w is about peace and love, and the fact that we can do it here and uh, get on stage and give a message of peace and love, which is what Lai was trying to do on stage, you know. My name's Ed Kowalczyk, two letters and then about three trillion, so I'm into contrast. I think there's beauty in contrast and beauty in uh, variety, which is another thing about this concert. It's about these kids and their music and their time, 1999, and I could feel that they wanted to make it special today. They wanted a special vibe today, and, and we we're just trying to help out. There's beauty in you, man. Have a happy All right, life. Thank you, brother. All right. Thanks, Thank you. Live from Woodstock in Rome, New York, John Guerra, BD, and right now we're between set changes. Alanis Morissette just came off the stage. We're now waiting for Limp Biscuit to go on stage. Limp Biscuit's in about 20 minutes from right now. Meanwhile, a pay-per-view, they're running around looking for more naked people. It's unbelievable. This is uh, this is like the early Woodstock. I mean, everybody's, uh, except everybody's like Abercrombie out. It's very, very nice and dressed well. I mean, it's the uh, topless Britney Spears lookalike contest, right? 
really, it was really tough when we first got here on Wednesday. We've been here since then. Uh, Thursday and yesterday, Friday, you could not use your cell phone, which is one of the big tragedies of this whole thing. Everyone's running around with a little cell phone. But today it was great because everybody's battery went dead. So <laughs> plenty of free nodes and all that. Request lines open here to Woodstock, 1-800-669-1010. Later on tonight, we hope to be talking to Alanis and Everclear and Kid Rock and all the people who are here at uh, the Woodstock concert. You stay tuned. 800-669-1010 for what you want to hear. My name's Gary Rubino. Hollywood Records presents Fastball. Open House Party. Tonight from Griffiths Air Force Base in Rome, New York. Live, it's Woodstock 99. In my shoes, my toes are busted. My kitchen says my bread is molded. Now, now I'm real thirsty. Hey, this is Hannah. Brooke, Kate, and Lindsay. We're, We're from Burlington, Vermont. <laughs> Tonight, the final super concert of the 20th century, Woodstock 99. From Rome, New York, the biggest party on the planet, celebrating the biggest concert in the world. Live from Woodstock. Hello. Hey. What's hey, up? how you doing? <laughs> How's it, Rob? <laughs> You're coming from a long way away. Uh, Elbow Beach, Hawaii. Where's that? Way on the island of Oahu. Wow, that's a long ass airplane, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be in New York, brother. What song you wanna hear? Uh, I wanna hear the song by uh, Too Close uh, called uh, By Next. Oh, yeah, we've been watching a lot of that on TV tonight. Uh, oh, yeah, way too close. <laughs> Nobody's dancing that close tonight. <laughs> That's it, that's it, brother. Oh, you having a good time? Oh, have a great time. All right, well, thanks for coming by. Everyone give a big hand. Let's have a Hawaii. Thanks, buddy. Live from Woodstock. Open House Party. Tonight, live from Woodstock. Dave Matthews, Sugar Ray, Offspring, Jamiroquai, Big Boy Slim, Everclear, Everlast, Cheryl Crow, Brian Titzer, Joel, Counting Crow, Linus Morrison, and the fabulous Open House Party Mud Wrestling Team. Airy, 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 airy. Ah, I got gotcha. you. Isn't that cool? High tech. I don't know nothing about that stuff. I'm sure you don't. <laughs> I'm still in a 58. <laughs> Open house party. We're here with Kid Rock here at uh, South Park. Hello. Hey, what's happening, world? So isn't this nice here, huh? Yes. You're more popular than Britney, Britney Spears after the operation. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'll make that chick see God. <laughs> <laughs> so what's going on? What's going to set for tonight? Her. <laughs> I don't know. If, I don't know if she's seen the back of the bus yet. <laughs> I'm gonna hit her, baby, one more time. <laughs> she can sing that to me all night. Hit me, baby, one, one more. Boom! Time. Oh. <laughs> Have you ever met her? No. She's touring around too. Maybe. She wants me, dude. She does. She totally you know, wants me. She's that sweet southern chick who likes some some bad guy. She wants some rock and roll in her life so bad. Oh, you can rock and roll her all night long. I'll put the kid back in her rock. So you're from Detroit City. Detroit Rock City, yeah, yes. People listening to Detroit right now. Yes. And uh, we're talking about the fact that uh, a lot of people don't realize Detroit is like Motown, but Detroit is like was a rock city before it was MC5, Motown. MC5, Iggy, Bob Seger, Ted, you know, everything. Oh. I'm actually from Romeo, Michigan, but Detroit is what I claim since it's closest. How far art thou, Romeo? Where's that from? Yeah, about 30 miles north, a little hick town. So what's your Woodstock experience been so far? Uh, a lot of cameras, a lot of press, rock the house, and I'm um, knocking back the beers as we go, and I'm going to get into so I think, uh, I think our debauchery level is almost at DEFCON 5, so I'm working my way back to you, babe. And, I, I saw you talking to Kennedy a few minutes ago. Yeah. I noticed last night she's in the same hotel we're at, and she's got one of the nicest butts. She's got a big ass, man. I'm, she's I'm like trying, a bubble ass, right? I just smack it, flip it, rub it down. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> well, you do a great show tonight, kid. Thank you. 
Kid Rock, thanks for talking to me. No problem, man. Open house party, over there. Anytime. Open house party. Hi, John. Hello, everybody. Johnny from Cranston. That's right. How come you're not here at Woodstock, Johnny? Oh, I I don't know how to get in. That's why. You don't know how to get here? No. Well, you go to Providence Airport to get a plane. Yeah, well, I'm broke. <laughs> oh, all right. That's not all. What do you want to hear? Tonight, I want to hear Alina Smurf that you learned. All right. And I want to wish her luck at Woodstock 99. Oh, she's she's uh, on stage already, and she'll be coming off any second. Okay, and tell her I'm eating, I'm eating her favorite sandwich, too, peanut butter and fluff. How do you know that? Oh, because I talked to her on Pro FM way back when she was at Pro FM. That's great. All right, we're well, yes. from Cranston. Thanks for calling over House Party United Woodstock. Thank you. Bye-bye. There it is. <laughs> the bingo bus and the biggest party on the planet to end the millennium. This is what Prince was talking about in the song 1999. There's so much going on tonight. The sun is setting right now here over Woodstock, which is actually nowhere near Woodstock, New York, which is actually closer to New York City than where we are. We are upstate up in Rome, New York, here in the uh, beautiful... Uh, um, I don't know. This isn't the Adirondacks. What is it? The Erie Canal area. The Erie Canal goes right through Rome. In fact, we go over it on our secret back road uh, when we get from the hotel back to Woodstock. The traffic has been unbelievable, backed up all on the New York State Thruway. It's taken people a couple of hours to get in, but th th there's been surprising little trouble. There have only been about 15 or 20 arrests, mostly for uh, drunk and disorderly or drunken driving. One guy last night was arrested. Uh, no, he wasn't arrested. He went up to a police car and asked to be taken to the stage. He thought it was a taxi. Yeah. <laughs> it's Woodstock 1999. My name's John Garabedian. Your requester would make the whole thing run. 800 669 1010. We're on the phones, right? Taking those calls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give us one now. We have some superstar stuff coming up. Don't go away. The legendary, legendary. Open House Party. Open House Party for Woodstock. Jennifer Lopez, 29 years old today. Up on stage, Lynn Biscuit is still finishing up their set. Puff Daddy is up there. Standing next to Kid Rock. <laughs> what a wild night this is, and no rain. Woodstock 99, perfect. Open house. If you had my love, this is T Bird from New York. Hey, this is Dave and Rob giving a shout out from Woodstock, Houston, Texas. Hi, I'm Kelly. And Lisa, shout out to Somerset, where Woodstock get naked and drunk. Woo -hoo! Truth is, I thought it mattered. Open House Party from Woodstock Live, and here's Kennedy. Hello. Hi. You're the host of the pay-per-view thing. I am. Can you believe it? I know. And what are people paying to view? All the women bouncing their boobies up and down. Yeah, well, you can't see it in, on cable, so you got to pay for it. <laughs> but for some people, that's a good time. What do you do to prep for this? Very little. Try and get some sleep and wear lots of sunscreen. How much sleep did you get last night? Seven hours. Wow. But that was interrupted great. twice by two middle-of-the-night phone calls. And how do you stay so white? You don't have any sun. Excellent sunscreen. SPF 50? No, it's actually SPF 24, but it just reapplication is key. Because you look great. Oh, thanks. So what? do you. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. <laughs> As part of uh, what we do, we, we put our radio show up on the satellite. We have to call the uh, General Electric uplink facility in Vernon Valley, New Jersey, where they up they control all the satellites. And we called there to make sure the satellite was all lined up. And they were saying, "What do they show those rock bands for? We want to see more of them women." Oh yeah. And, and they're all sitting at the uplink. You think they're controlling the satellites? They're watching women bearing their breasts. Oh, they'll get plenty of that this weekend. It's <laughs> going to get hotter and hotter, and they'll be redder and redder. So. Kennedy, thanks for talking to us. Thanks, have guys. A, have a great show. Open house. Woo! Open house party. Tonight, from Griffiths Air Force Base in Rome, New York, Woodstock 99, a half million people strong, and it's only right you, you should be one of us. Woodstock, who's this? 
This is Jeremy from Barnwell, South Carolina. What are you doing tonight, Jeremy? We're partying. Well, good. You can party with us here, too. All right. What do you want to hear? I would like to hear the Rockefeller Skank by Fatboy Slim, please. Oh, he's going to be spinning at midnight tonight in the all-night rave in the aircraft hangar. Cool. Right here at Woodstock. All right. <laughs> Woo! All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Over and out. Hi, this is Jessica Nelson. This is Corinne Yonker. We're from Long Island. We're here in Woodstock Topless, and I'd love to give a shout-out to my mom. I'm sorry I stole the car to come here, and to my boyfriend, Ryan, and the NRC in Hicksville. Rockin' in Woodstock! Woo! Open house party. It's John Garvey in Woodstock with beautiful women everywhere. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. And people are here from all over America and all over the world. Where are you from? Utica. Utica, 10 miles from here. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Are you having a good time? Yes. A ball. <laughs> We're not naked yet. Well, the key word is yet. <laughs> what song do you want to hear? Someday, Someday by Sugar Ray. Oh, who didn't play because he got sick. He had a viral infection. Yes. I love him. Mark McGrath. I'm in love with him. If he's listening in the hospital, what do you want to say to him? I love you, Mark. I wish I could be there to make you feel song. better. <laughs> Woodstock. Open house party from Woodstock and John Garabedian. You know, I'm amazed that more people haven't gotten food sickness because, uh, you know, there's so much food here and they have to keep the food all preserved and everything and know how many people are coming out. And uh, I decided I wasn't going to eat any food at Woodstock after I found out the health inspector's name was Dr. Sal Manella. So uh, that's... We just got word, uh, as you know, there's been no rain. Right now, it's uh, 9.35 here at uh, Rome, New York, at Woodstock, and there's been no rain at all. They're saying it's going to be the perfect Woodstock. We just got word on the scanner that there's an electrical storm headed this way. Oh, no. So, it, and it's just before Metallica comes on. And in 1994, at the 25th anniversary of Woodstock, it was right after Metallica finished that all of a sudden, I started feeling raindrops on my bare arms. I got, uh-oh, I think it's going to rain. Some guy walked out on the stage and said, we just heard from the National Weather Service in Albany on radar. Uh, big thunderstorms headed this way. Stay away from the speaker towers. Stay away from the fences. Everybody get down. He might have well said, run, run, and everybody was going crazy. And, of course, the sky opened up, and about a half hour later, in the rain, Aerosmith came on to play, which they aren't this year. We are about to leave here. We have to run down. We've just been cleared to go into Alanis Morissette's dressing room, and we're going to get Alanis Morissette for you in about five or ten minutes. Stay tuned. Open House Party live from Woodstock. Open House Party. 30 years after the original. It's Woodstock 99, live from Rome, New York. Open House Party. We're here in the uh, dressing room with Alanis Morissette. Hello, Alanis. Hi, how are you? Hello, Alanis. <laughs> <laughs> it's an honor to be with you. It's good to be here. Well, it's so nice in here. It's air conditioned and quiet compared to out there. Yes, it's very peaceful in here. It's quite a contrast. Yes. Uh, first of all, I want to say how shocked I was the first time I spoke to you about how gracious and lovely you are. Oh. Is that shocking? <laughs> well, all that music from that first album, which was, uh, you know, angry and, you know, all this vented stuff. Right. Uh, that's a, one part of me. I still have anger, believe me, but it's not a one-dimensional kind of deal. Well, the new album is sort of like the, the other side of that, I guess. A lot of the songs yeah, in there. Yeah, other sides, definitely. I think every record will always explore other elements of who we are. So being a spiritual person, which a lot of the things in your album reflect, the, your trip to India and so forth and, and how you've developed... You must have thought about what Woodstock stands for, this being the 30th anniversary, and, and you know how you were going to approach it. I, I'm happy to be here in that I'm it's pretty insulated and isolated when you tour on your own, so to be able to actually be amongst other artists is amazing to begin with, and then to have it be something that is um, commemorative of the original one is just giving us an indication of how things have changed and evolved, not only from the original one years ago, but even from the one in 1994, just to see the growth and change is pretty amazing. What does Woodstock mean in 1999? It means an opportunity for Americans to come together and, and Canadians and North Americans in general, I guess. I'm sure some people have flown over the ocean as well for this, but for us to just come together and to be free and liberated and, and forget about everything for three days other than music that may touch us. Like quarter million souls just 
jumping together and dancing together. Yeah, what a great opportunity. Is there anything in your set that uh, you know reflects that? Um, I just feel humbled every time I'm able to sing a song to even one person, so to sing it to this amount of people is pretty amazing. Well, I wish you a wonderful weekend. Thank you. And I hope you get a chance to get out there and uh, mingle. mingle with the crowds. <laughs> I, I hope I can. Yeah, that'd be great. The last bar set. Thanks for being with us at Open House Party. Thank you. Open House Party live from Woodstock. Da, da, da. Rage Against the Machine is up on stage right now. The official count of ticket sales, we understand, is over 330,000. And uh, Rage Against the Machine now. Metallica is coming on later. Of course, we play lots of Metallica songs here on Open House Party. <laughs> With that little drummer. And uh, John Garabini, we have more stuff for you coming up all night long, including the all-night rave going on at the aircraft hangar. You stay tuned. Biggest party on the planet and the biggest concert of the 20th century. Open House Party. Open House Party at Woodstock. Hello. Hi. What's your name? My name's Kimmy. And Kimmy, where are you from? I'm from Honesdale, Pennsylvania. Where's Honesdale? It's near Scranton, Wilkes-Barre, about three hours away from here. Well, that's not too bad a drive. No, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> all self-conscious, huh? <laughs> yeah. Who'd you come up with? Um, I came up by myself to see my friend. Oh, okay. Well, uh, what song we play for you? Um, let's hear Madonna, Beautiful Stranger from the Austin Powers. Powers. What's up, <laughs> Like the movie? Uh, yes, it's very good. My favorite person in the movie was Robin Swallows. I thought she was great. <laughs> yes. Brilliant actress. Too. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, nice to Thank you. Haven't we met? Hello. Hey. Will? Yeah. Will Turpin of Collective Soul? This is he. Hey, how are you? Good. Where are you located at? Uh, we're in Syracuse right now. We're getting ready to come down there in a little bit. Oh, no wonder we had to do you on the phone, so to speak. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you haven't been there yet? No. Oh, it's great. It's absolutely great. It's, well, the people are all good-spirited. It hasn't rained. Hardly any mud. Yeah, I've been watching a little bit on MTV and stuff. So. Yeah, yeah. So are you looking forward to playing? Yeah, we're, we're really looking forward to it. I mean, we're, we were lucky enough to play the 25th as well, so it's... Uh, it's a cool opportunity to be one of the bands that got to play both of them. The biggest thing you notice about this site is it's much, much bigger than the site in Socrates. Yeah, I saw some pictures from the air, and it's, uh, it's totally different. It's just like a wide open space, and that's a lot different from what it was at uh, Socrates. You guys have anything you thought of to do special for this one? Yeah, we got a couple cover tunes we're going to uh, do that, that, uh, that'll fire everybody up, I believe. Wycliffe Gene was up this afternoon doing uh, old Chuck Berry songs. Yeah, cool. It was wild. Uh, we're coming down later tonight. Check out Rage and uh, Metallica. All right. Well, we'll see you when you get here. Yeah. And thanks for talking to us at Open House Party. All the ladies are hanging out here to say Will Turbin from Collective Soul. Hello, ladies. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Why drink? Josh Bruce from the Point, Ohio. Welcome to Woodstock, Josh. Hello. What do you want to hear? I want to hear Blue Monday by Orgy. Oh, yeah. We'll play that for you right now. All right. I can hardly hear you because I've got this big tour bus. Dave Matthews tour bus is right next to us. Oh, really? Yeah, you hear it? Yeah, I can hear you. I want to dedicate this song to B. Quinn Rick and Captain Crossy. All right. Well, thanks for calling Open House Party. Thank you. All right. Bye. Three. Woo! How does it feel? Hi, I'm Elise from Los Angeles. Hey, this is Tracy and Chrissy from Coleman, Michigan. You make it in Woodstock. I'm Bob. I'm at Woodstock eating nachos and very happy. Open House Party. John Garabedian and his Open House Party at Rills. Here's Johnny. Open House Party. Woodstock artist. <laughs> it's lit. They did a great show yesterday. <laughs> Although they're playing a little bit fast. 
Live from Woodstock, John Garabini and an open house party, 1999. This is it, the summer of 99. Next year is the 21st century, and everybody's really celebrating tonight like it's 1999. As you heard Kurt Loder said, the word is that Prince may show up tomorrow night to finish the whole thing off with the Star Spangled Banner, because on the program they've handed out to all the media people, it says to TBA Jimi Hendrix. So who would like Jimmy Henry? Prince, he plays guitar. He's got a new band together. That looks like a very exciting thing. Meanwhile, tonight, later on, the uh, rave is coming up. Uh, with uh, Fatboy Slim and Moby and uh, uh, what's his name, Perry Farrell, who will be uh, spinning all night long in the big abandoned airplane hangar here at the Griffiths Air Force Base, which is, by the way, got a huge runway. The runway is so huge, this is the backup landing site for the space shuttle. It's uh, two miles long, and the stages are all set up on the runway, if you watched any of this on TV. Standing by, we are trying to get Everclear and uh, Fatboy Slim and maybe some other surprises for you, too, as Open House Party goes on through the night, live from yeah! Woodstock, 1999. Hey everybody, this is Jeff. Hey, this is Eddie. This is Tony. This is Elliot. And this is CP. We're having a wild time here with John Garabedian at the Open House Party with the Blessed Union of Souls. She don't care about my car. Open house party. Hello, is this Norman? It certainly is. Uh, Who's this? Nor- the Fat Boy Slim? No, 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 I'm Fat Boy Slim. Who are you? The, the Funk Soul Brother? No, 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 I'm the Funk Soul Brother. Who are you? I'm John Garabedian, the Crazy Armenian. Nice to speak to you. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Welcome to Woodstock. Uh, thank you very much. Thanks for having us. You just where got- are, you? are you on site? Yes, but I'm over across where I can't see you. All right, well, listen, I'm waving now. You're right down by the John Lennon Can songwriting you bus. Waving? I'm the school one. I've got a T-shirt on with Make Love Not War on it, and oh. I'm waving now. Well, let's make more love. Okay. And there are a lot of people that I think I could do that with. <laughs> let's not go there. So what's the deal on the rave tonight? They canceled the one on uh, Friday morning, so t- so tonight is going to be a real big one then. Really? Yeah. It's not more of okay. You too do a great thing. And sunshine and the corporate thing I was expecting. I was very pleasantly surprised. Yeah, it kind of was. The site is so much better, and the weather's been great. Yeah, I think the weather always makes a difference. It puts a smile on everyone's face, doesn't it? Well, after we get off the air here, I'm coming over to hear you spin. Okay. Fat Boy Slim talking to us at Open House Party. Norman Cook, have a great time tonight. Yeah, enjoy the rest of the weekend. You too. Do a great set. Thanks, man. Live from Woodstock, Open House Party. Metallica's on one stage. Chemical Brothers on the other. Satellite Mega Mix next, Open House Party. Now. Now. Ranking three of the world's hottest clubs. Open house party. Satellite Mega Mix. We kick off tonight with DJ Alan Jeffrey at Limelight in New York City. Hello, Alan. Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? Doing great. What's hot tonight? Oh, Lord. The place is off the hook. You think it's hot outside? It is hot in this mother. They're jumping off the roof, bro. What, what do we use to kick off the mix tonight, Al? Uh, we're going to kick it off with the remix, All or Nothing by Cher. Good song. Where do we go to next? Uh, we'll be going to Ward Wilson at the John B. in Vancouver. Jagadelic, baby. Maybe the second song in the mix is going to be the killer remix of Britney Spears Sometimes. And now we're off to David Garcia at Club X in San Francisco. Thanks. The last song in the mix is by The Tamperer, if you buy this record, on the Open House Party Satellite Mega Mix. Clinton, New York. Hi, this is Kristen Schumbeck from Utica. <laughs> We're the only girls not naked at Woodstock. Woodstock! Hey, this is Julie Moore, Commercial City, Maryland. This is Josh from out Indiana, and we're having a f-ing killer time at Woodstock. Hi, it's Kylie and Jen from Salem, Massachusetts, and we're sweating our asses off here down at Woodstock 99, baby. Hello, guys. Hello. What's up, man? Hello, hello, hello. 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 I know, huh? Yeah, so what's the most interesting question all these people have asked you? Oh, it's just like, are you feeling love? I'm feeling <laughs> no love. That was 30 years ago. Yeah. All the love is gone. All the love is gone. Actually, they probably figured out how to do this right this time, wouldn't you say? Well, see, that's, I think that's the problem you were mentioning that, yeah. is I think that they did it so well. He's, got, he's a big guy. Look at that. He's a big guy. They're size 16, you know what they say. <laughs> oh. Is it true? Yeah. Big feet, big big shoes. That's it. (laughs) 
big soup bill. So what were you saying? They got they got Woodstock together. I think they got it so together that nothing can go wrong, so nothing can go right, right? Yeah, I don't yeah. think anything magical is going to happen because, well, well, God, we're on an Air Force base. I know. You know do, do you think they'd have the first one on the Air Force base? No. I don't think uh -uh. so. And they said that all day today, Saturday, it was going to rain. It didn't rain. It's great. Sun's out. It's beautiful. beautiful. 85 it's degrees. Beautiful. Amazing. They must have paid somebody off. God likes everybody. I'm sure they have the money. I think that's what it is. So what, what is the most interesting question all these people with all these cameras and everything have asked you so far? Uh, I can't think of one. Uh, well, this one uh, woman asked me if I was a hermaphrodite. I wasn't there for that one. That was the most interesting one. What made her think that? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no. You know. Wink, wink. All right, what do you want to say to all your fans all over? Uh... I'm not a hermaphrodite. All right, and <laughs> ever clear. And we're here. Thanks for talking to us. Have a great show. Good to see you. Great seeing you too. Thanks. Open house party for Woodstock. The wind just picked up. And on the America Online radar, we can see the thunderstorms about to hit the big field. It's going to be a mess out there. <laughs> Open house party. John Garabini, thank you for being here with tonight. And as we always say, be your dream. So, Rod, they say your new album, 